problem. Got hey! It. What's the idea of barging in here? Get out of here, or I'll call the guards. Pudu, Tony Rama na praka donkot sercha chupa punky. Hey, baby, wait. I wasn't actually going. Damn it! Okay, great. You just scared off my date for the night. So you better explain yourself before I lose my temper and call the guards. Uh uh. No way. You're not getting out of this mess that easy. You can explain yourself to the guards if you live long enough for them to question you. Here! I'm here. Here it is! Sure. That'll show you. What can I do? Yeah. <laughs> 
Thank you. You have no idea what it was like in that torture cage. I don't know how much more I could take before going mad. I used to be the pilot of the Ebonhawk, Davik's flagship. I know the codes to disable the security system protecting it. I'll load them onto your data pad now. You can use those codes to steal the Ebonhawk right out of its hangar. Sell it to the highest bidder, ransom it back to Davik. Whatever you do, you'll make thousands. What? But I, I don't have anything else. Those Ebonhawk codes are worth a fortune. Isn't that enough? Please, just let me go. It won't be long until Davik figures out I'm free. I have to get out of this base before that happens. We've got what we came for. We should get going. How dare you invade my chambers? How rude! I am a personal guest of Davik himself. I left specific instructions that you guards were not to disturb me until morning. How can Davik expect me to invest in his ventures with this kind of incompetence on display? I should summon the other guards and report you to your commanding officer. Well, I suppose I can forgive the intrusion in this case. Tell Davik I admire a host who has his underlings check up on the well-being and comfort of his guests. I don't require anything right now. You can tell Davik everything about my stay has been most pleasing so far. Here's a five-credit chip for your trouble, sir. Don't work for Davik. Then what are you... Plus! Assassins! Guards! Save me! Here! This is what I Huh? Sure. I'm here. Huh? Sure. Thank you. 
I'm here. Huh? Sure. Yes? Yes? They're bombing the whole planet. I knew they'd turn on the sooner or... Oh, look what we got here. Thieves in a hangar. So, you figured you'd just steal my ship for your getaway and leave me high and dry while the Sith turned the planet into dust? Sorry, but that ain't gonna happen. I'll take care of them, Davik. I've been looking forward to this for a long time. Make it quick, Carlo. The Sith mean business. If we don't get to our ships and find somewhere safe, the bombs there drop and will kill us all.
outnumbered and outgunned. But if I'm going down, I'm taking all of you with me. This thermal detonator will blow us all to bits. Damn no shit! Now bring this whole hangar down around our ears! What? Yes? Let's get this ship fired up. We'll pick up the rest of your friends and then we'll have to get off this planet. Taris is defenseless against our assault, Lord Malak. They are offering no resistance. The city is in ruins. Resume the bombardment, Commander. Wipe this pathetic planet from the face of the galaxy. Plot a course for Dantooine. There's a Jedi Enclave there where we can find refuge. Incoming fighters! Quickly, to the gun turrets. You have to hold the Sith fighters off until we get those hyperspace coordinates punched in. Between 
seems like a lifetime since I last set foot on her surface. Though in truth, it's only been a few months. We should be safe from Malak here. For now, at least. Safe? You saw what his fleet did to Terrace. There wasn't a building over two stories high left standing. They, they turned the planet into one big pile of rubble. Even the Sith would think twice before attacking Dantooine. There are many Jedi here, including several of the most powerful Masters of the Order. There is great strength within this place. We can't just keep running. Malak will find us eventually. We need to regroup. We need a plan. We can get supplies here and recuperate. The Academy is a place of mental and spiritual healing. Something we could all use after what we've been through. Maybe you're right. It isn't easy to witness the annihilation of the entire planet. I know Mission must be taking it pretty hard. She will find a way to come to terms with her grief. She's stronger than she appears. We just need to give her time. Now I must go speak with the Council. I need their advice on recent developments. After I've met with them, I will meet you outside the ship. I've spoken briefly with the Council. They request an audience with you. We should go at once. An audience with the Jedi Council? It's pretty unusual for someone who isn't even a Jedi. What's this about, Bastila? I'm sorry, Karth, but I cannot tell you. All I ask is that you trust in the Force and the wisdom of the Council. Well, I don't like being left out of the loop, but I'm not looking to get you in any trouble with the Jedi Masters. We'll do things your way for a while. Come. They're expecting us. I will lead you to the Council Chambers. 